Hey guys, good evening and welcome back again to your Unacademy Neat English channel. I hope all of you are doing amazing, all of you are doing great. So my dear students, a fresh update has come related to the re-neat. And what is this update exactly all about? The update is from NTA side, right? An affidavit has been filed in the Supreme Court by NTA. Now what this affidavit is exactly all about? What NTA is telling before the judgment which is going to be there on 8th of July, right? Let's exactly have a look on this particular affidavit which has been submitted by NTA uh, right uh, in the Supreme Court before the judgment which is scheduled on 8th of July. My dear students, if you look at the recent tweet, if you look at the recent tweet, uh, NTA also files affidavit in Supreme Court, right? NTA also files the affidavit in the Supreme Court opposing the cancellation of the NEET UG examination. NTA says, uh, the alleged malpractices were only in Patna and Godra centers and entire examination should not be cancelled based on the individual instances, right? So my dear students, this is one of the affidavit which has been submitted by NTA where NTA is telling only in the two centers of Patna and the Godra district, right? There were some discrepancies related to the paper leak and everything. Rest, all the other places, there were there was no paper leak, there was no discrepancy, right, etc, etc. So there should not be any re-examination. This is the affidavit which has been submitted by NTA right now in the Supreme Court, right? Let's have a look on this particular news in detail. Okay, have a look people. See guys, cancelling NEET would be betrayal to the promising students, NTA files reply in the Supreme Court. So, of course, this is absolutely clear, right? It is absolutely going to be the betrayal for all the students who did really well, right? With their 100% honest efforts in the NEET 2024 examination. And if the re-NEET is happening, definitely it's going to be a betrayal fall uh, to all of them, right? Let's have a look on this particular news a bit more in detail. Okay, the National Testing Agency on Friday filed a reply in the Supreme Court uh, in the NEET case. The next hearing... Just a second. Uh, just, just a second, guys. Okay. Okay, let's let's read it. The next hearing is slated for July 8. Chief Justice of India, right, will hear a consolidated play related to the need case. In the affidavit, NTA said that the CBI is investigating the matter as there have been complaints of the paper leak of this exam in many states. Okay, the, the agency also said that several uh, arrests have been made in the cases related to the need paper leak. The probe is going on to find out the organized gang and the mastermind behind the paper leak. Replying to the re-need petition, NTA said that steps were taken as soon as the information of paper leak was received, but cancelling the examination is not appropriate. This would be better to the promising students. A bench of CJI, uh, DJ and the justices, this, 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 will hear the batch of petitions in the challenging, uh, in the challenging, in challenging the, in challenging the alleged malpractices and irregularities in the NEET 2024 on July 8th in the Supreme Court. Earlier this week, Prime Minister Narendra Modi uh, addressed the NEET paper leak issue in the parliament during his speech on the motion of thanks of the President's speech, Prime Minister Narendra Modi on Tuesday, while referring to the alleged NEET scam, addressed the issue of paper leaks in the country, saying that government is working on war footing uh, to take steps to bring the culprits to justice. PM Modi assured the country that the government is taking critical steps to address the NEET examination leak controversy, adding that those messing with the Indian youth's future will not be spared. Addressing the Lok Sabha, Prime Minister Modi said, I'll tell every student of the country, every youth of the country that the government is very serious about preventing such incidents and we are taking one step after another to fulfill all our responsibilities on war, war footing. Those who play with the future of the youth will not be spared at all. So my dear students, this was the latest speech by our Prime Minister in the Parliament uh, which was absolutely related to the NEET examination only where he categorically told if there are any sort of discrepancies, whosoever is going to be involved in the discrepancy, they are not going to be spared at all. Now, the main point is that is that is the affidavit which has been submitted by the NTA in the Supreme Court. What NTA wants, NTA has clearly mentioned, yes, there have been some discrepancies in the state of Patna, right? I mean, in the in, in Patna, in some centers of Patna and in, uh, in the Godra centers, perfect, wherein there were some discrepancies related to the paper leak, etc. All the other centers wherein the NEET examination has happened, it has happened with 100% transparency as per NTA. Perfect. So they have submitted this particular affidavit in the Supreme Court. Now the final hearing is going to be on 8th, right? So my dear students, I'll tell you something. 
with all these things, with all the things which have been happened on the social media from the NTA side, from the Supreme Court side, side from the uh, speeds in the parliament, right? The speeds by different political leaders, the speeds by the different, uh, by the, our education minister, right? It is clearly visible now that it there won't be renewed to all the students who have written the NEET 2024 examination, right? There is 99% probability that renewed is not going to happen because the counseling dates are also not changed or counseling has not been stopped, etc, etc, right? If there was the chance, slight chance of the renewed, then definitely the counseling date dates would have been altered for sure. Perfect. So be prepared now, all those students who did not want renewed to happen. So the case is going in favor of you. I'm pretty much sure about that and 99.9% .9 chance are there that there'll be no renewed examination at all. And all the students watching me from the South India, from the particularly the state of Tamil Nadu. My dear students, for all the NEET 2025 aspirants, as I promised to give you one-on-one -on -one mentorship, yes, we are ready with that. And my dear students, on Sunday, on Sunday at 11 a.m., on coming Sunday, day after tomorrow at 11 a.m., right, uh, the date is 17th of July, I will meet all the students of Tamil Nadu in the Unacademy Center, Chennai, which is there in Annanagar East. I am personally going to be there and we'll have one-on-one -on -one mentor sessions with all of you. I'll exactly understand how exactly your preparation has been going on and how you can improvise it. And it's going to be in-person discussion. So all the students, right, who are from the state of Tamil Nadu, who are particularly in Chennai or some adjacent place of Chennai, you are most welcome in this seminar. The seminar is going to happen in the Unacademy Center, right, which is there in Chennai, Annanagar East, right? You guys are most welcome. I'll be personally there. I'll meet you in person, wherein I'll let you know exactly how to deal with the NEET 2025 examination. I'll let you know all the things which are required for this computer examination to be cracked, right? So anyone whosoever has been my student in the past from the Chennai, right? Or some adjacent parts of the Chennai or the ones who are currently studying from me either in on YouTube or in the batches, you guys are most welcome, right? Be there on Sunday in the Unacademy Center, Chennai, right? Which is exactly in Annanagar East. I would want to see every one of you to be there and just fill this particular form right, which I'm going to pin in the description box of this video as well, right? Do click on this particular form and fill the form so that I'll get to know how many people exactly are coming to meet us, right, in person. Perfect. If you are need 2025 aspirant, 26 aspirant, or if you have been my student before, you guys are most welcome. Let's catch up for the first time in person, face to face, wherein I'll be talking to all my students, right, from the South Indian part, right? So with this, I'll be taking a leave. Take care. God bless you all and love you all guys. Bye-bye.